My name is Dr. Solomon, aka Mama Boudoua. The topic for today, I'd like all of us to talk about is how do we undo all these men that are after married women? And the other way around as well, married women that are after married men. Your advice, your comments, what you think, how you think we can deal with this issue. Because take it or leave it, except we want to deceive ourselves. These things are happening. And um, this reminds me of a chat I had with someone sometimes back, where I asked, why are men disturbing married women these days? And the response the man gave me was that, um, being a married woman, the man, there won't be issue of a, uh, I'm pregnant. There won't be issue of a, uh, uh, come and pay my house rent. There won't be issue of a, uh, come and do this, come and do that. Because the woman will be afraid that if this is done, the husband will be questioning. And in that, when you now know that this thing you're doing is not right, for your own selfish interest, and my question is, if someone is doing this to your wife or your husband, will you be happy? It's not something which you just neglect or think is not happening. It's happening. And like I always say, if your neighbor's house, if, you're, if there's trouble, if there's fire in, the, in your neighbor's house, maybe it's four or five houses away and you cannot... Look for solution. God forbid, if that fire is not quenched, something will happen. So what did you think we can do? Married men, married women that are after each other. What can we, how can we solve this problem? A lady brought this question up again yesterday, even though I had it on my list for us to discuss this week. That's how do we undo? How do we handle this matter? that married men are not aligned married women to rest now. And I, in my own case, I'm like, if the married women are not responding, I'm not sure they, they will continue. If one or two, if they are spoken with five and four has dealt with them or neglected them or trashed the issue, issue and let them know that it is not right, they will not pro proceed. But because they are getting yes, they are getting, they are, they are getting positive answers. That's why they are continuing. So, viewers, what is your take on this matter? How do you think we can stop this? Or how do you think we can undo this? Or what are the things that you think is causing all this? Think, 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 think. What do you think that is? I want to, I want to read from you. I want to hear from you. What do we do to the married men that are after married women? Knowing that they are married. And married women that are after married men. Knowing that they are married. No matter what is causing it. Let me tell you another thing that I know. No matter how a married man is treating you. That is not you that is not the wife. Trust me. It's just. It's just arranging. Pretends. They are pretending. Trust me, if it take you through one month, two months, three months, four, five, whichever months, it depends on how long it can take it. If he is able to manage it from that period, he will treat you the same way he's treating the wife at home. Because it's just a matter of time and his familiarity. Say, ah, after all, is that, is, that, is that not my wife? Okay, someone dropped something. I like serious is happening. Okay, I like serious is happening. It's not like before that you tell something that you are married that they will leave you alone. Not now. Oh, oh. If it is, I said someone said it is, they want to, what they want to even hear now is that they are happy that you're married. And the moment they see ring. And no, now another one is guys that are not married. Are after the ladies that are married what are the solution what did you think we can do about these things someone just agreed now that is happening yes we all know it's happening it is before 
you will say, ah, can't you see I'm married? Some will even apologize. I could remember years back, years back, a guy, a, a guy toasted me and I'm like, I was heavily pregnant. Not early stage, even the blind could see that I was pregnant. And I'm like, are you not seeing? Are you blind? And he's like, eh? It doesn't matter. Uh -uh. You mean it doesn't matter? If this is done to your wife, how will you feel? Yeah, if my wife can handle it, I say, God, this world has ended. Now, let the married women tell the married man that if he can tell her husband that he wants to be the, you be sleeping with her. Yes, this take me to his story. There was a guy, a man, an elderly man years back that was like, my husband is away. And uh, he was like, he, he, after all the disturbance, after all the bobo nibu, he said he wanted to travel out with me. And I'm saying, to travel out with me, just me and you, it's not a problem. I will allow you to travel with me, but on one condition. The condition is, my husband will travel with your wife to any country of their choice. And it was like, that was rude. I said, that means you two, you were rude to me and my husband. The thing, the man was not happy. He was mad at me, but I was happy I made him mad as well. I was happy I made him unhappy. I was happy I disrespected him. Because how can you just look, finish? He said, you want to take me out of my husband's house and travel. And I said, okay, this is not a problem. Travel, let, your, let my husband travel with your wife as well. And that pains him. So I was saying, if women, if the married women can deal with the issue, it will minimize or it will reduce. I'm just saying, I don't know. But the man never come back again. So, the one I was even saying again is, the young men that are not married, that are supposed to be looking for how to build future, how to settle down, it is married women they want to go after. Because they are lazy. As far as I'm concerned, the, 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 the married woman will now go and collect money or use our money, collect from her husband and go and. All these things are evil. They are not right. Whatever language, whatever name you call it, it is not right. How do we handle this? How do we rectify what has poor? It's happening. Or Another person will say, eh, it is because, it's because, it's because. Well, whatever your reason, sort yourself out. Sort yourself out and be fine. Everything, whatever you can do with another person's wife or another person's husband, you can as well do it with your husband or your wife. So, it will be on the YouTube, by the grace of God. Let me know what you think. And let me know what you think could be the solution. Because take it or leave it, it's happening. Till I come your way again, I remain your one and only Dr. Solomon, aka Mama Budra, the face behind Bedroom Zoom. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Budra Plus TV. Till I come your way again. Bye. Don't forget, be at peace with all men. Be at peace with your spouse. Be angry, but say not. Never allow the sun to go down with your wrath. He offended me yesterday. He offended me the day before yesterday. I will not forgive him. Forgive him or her. Because time wait for nobody. Love does not count offenses. Love forgive. Love is patient. Love is kind. Oh, sorry. Before I go, someone is saying something. Sorry, it was a mistake. What I am trying to say is that it is not like before that, okay, you will tell him and that you are married and that you let you go. They don't care even if you are married. Yes, we have really talked about this. Thank you and thank you everyone. Till I read from you until we see again. Thank you and thank you for believing in, in me. Put your applause. Bedroom Zone, please continue to follow and continue to subscribe. Fitra Plus TV on YouTube, Bedroom Zone on Instagram, and Bedroom Zone on Facebook.